hello guys i hope you all are safe and you all are keeping well today i am going to make a short video on parent and a child's closeness this topic is very sensitive and it's very close to my heart because i have been through something which i would want to share i feel that though i love my mother and father a lot but i was never close to them i could never confide in them i could never have a a talk a communication or a you know a, a very close talk with them where i could share my feelings or what i was going through or what i i believed in and what i wanted to do i loved them in a way where i really was petrified of my father so that closeness never came and with my mother she being a very gentle person and a person who couldn't uh, say much so she also could not understand and she could not say anything on my behalf i always feel that a parent and a child should have a relationship more than a friend i feel that my kids when they come and tell me the things which they would not share with anybody i feel very proud with the way i have brought them up or with the way i bond with them or with the way i understand what they are going through whether it they are breakups or they are some sort of uh, anguish that they are going through or in school in college anywhere in their work field whatever they feel they always come and confide in me tell me take my not take my advice actually i wouldn't advise i would just give my opinion and it is to them whether they want to heed my advice or they just want to do what they want to do that much of liberty you have to give to your kids because nowadays kids are not are not you know they are not going to come and tell you until you open up to them and you need to open up to your kids because they are your kids and you need to bring them up in such a loving way that they that whatever you feel whatever you feel even they should understand what you are feeling and what you are going through and be with you and even you should be there for each and every step of their life whether they whether they talk or they are at the bottom of the career or they have gone through something which is like very which is going to like you know break them or one of those good times which they would want to share with you when they have their first uh, date or the first um, love whatever it is they should come and confide in you i have been one of those lucky parents maybe because of my past experiences because i was never close to my my uh, father i could i was literally petrified of him so i could never never be close to him i could never tell him anything i couldn't open my mouth in front of him this was the case so i just i just uh, took a turn in my life and i always thought that i am going to be there for my kids no matter what no matter what and i have been lucky that they have always been so close to me and i feel that is a very big achievement you have because when you have kids you need to see their emotional growth their emotional problems any upheaval that they are having in their life they have to come and discuss with you whether they whether they like you know maybe they may not they may not uh, fully agree with what advice you give them that doesn't matter at all they need to come and they need to confide in you i would request each and every parent that be their friend because in these times these times are very hard on kids too it was hard on me too maybe 50 years back 55 years back when i was 5 or maybe when i was 10 i needed somebody because i don't have a sister so i always needed some somebody to talk to uh, and my friends were not that 
I mean, they were close to me, but I could not go and talk each and every thing to them. So somewhere I felt that 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 thing, like you know, I am still craving to have to have. My kids are there, but I still crave to have that kind of closeness with my sibling. I don't have a sister, but I have few of my friends whom I feel I can talk to now. Like you know, I have opened up now because I was a very reserved person, and because of the situations of my life, I had become very, very inward, totally intro introvert, and totally confused in my life because I had nobody to look up to and no one to hear what I'm going through. So today, I would just end with this: that please take care of your kids because they are the most important thing. to you and you need to come to a come to a a space where you can give them space and you can have your own space too and you need to be very very loving and very close to them this closeness only will come when you open up because the kids will always have this thing this respect of you being a parent but as you open up to them they will surely open up to you and it will be a fantastic relationship that you will share all your life so i would request you all to be the best of parent and to always not think of our past because if i would have thought that i did not have this so if i would have behaved the same way with my kids i would never ever be there um uh, there you know their rock exactly their rock i would never been i would have never been close and they would have never come and discussed with me anything so whatever your parents have done please don't do that to your kids if you have got beaten up or if you have got uh, you know if they have not understood you or they have thought that you know, falling in love was one big disgrace or whatever now i can't you know i cannot uh put everything across whatever problems that they have they have now they should be able to come and talk like i can say that my parents could not do it and i did not bring myself to that situation where my kids will not come and talk to me so please have a very very open and loving relationship with your kids and see it will work wonders on you because we are growing old and we need their love and compassion we need someone whom we can confide in to as we too are going through some times where we want somebody to like you know to comfort us as so i would like to only say that please love your kids the way you would love yourself thank you so much for watching and i hope i have said something that you will agree with please like comment and share my video thank you so much